All right, yo, what's up, guys? Got here battle versus uh, I don't know what the guy's name is, but it's the, the Don Donia, Don Donia, Donia, Don. I'm retarded. Anyways, got here battle. Uh, this guy has the weirdest of pokes. I don't even. When I saw this team, I was just like, what? What am I gonna? What? I see Shuckle and Doug Trio. What is this guy trying to prove? <laughs> like, I I don't know. Anyways, so. He also called me a kid before the battle, which was kind of annoying. But anyways, uh, he leads with a uh, Sableye, and I lead a Rolem. By the way, may I say, Sableye is the devil. I really hate Sableye. Somehow, it like got ba better from Gen 5 to 6. Nothing changed from it, it just got better, and I don't freaking know why. It's just more annoying every single time I see it. It's just like, yo, I'm going to troll you. I, I hate it. But, the one time I ever get a status infliction on a Sableye, he doesn't have, like, he has Lumberry. I'm like, what the, what the, the Lumberry, what? <laughs> and I almost cried. I literally did. Um, however, since uh, he saw the Willowist, I thought he was going to go for the Taunt, so I went for the Volt Switch. But he goes into Shuckle, and I was just like, oh, okay, Shuckle's cool and all, I guess. I decided to go into Fortress instead of Azumarill, because I was just like, well, I guess I could set up Spikes and in front of his face, and he can't really do anything about it. I thought he was going to set up the Sticky Web, but I guess he didn't, and just went for an uh, Infestation. Shuckle's alright, it's just it doesn't get Stealth Rocks yet. And without Stealth Rocks and... Inf uh, and sticky web, I don't see a use for it, but I could really see it being useful once it gets both, which will be available once uh, the Pokemon comes out. But anyways, uh, he went for infestation, so I thought you know he's probably not sticky web. He's some like rap set with toxic and rest and shit. But I guess he goes for sticky web randomly, and I was just like, well, that sucks. But since I'm out here already, I decided just to go for rest because I was just like, well, lol, I'll just go for rest because I can for free. And uh, he goes for Shell Smash, and I was just like, wait, what? I is this contrary? And then it is. And it's funny, I have never, I believe I have never battled a contrary Shuckle ever. And the time that I do is in a game where they actually have to make the Pokemon. And I don't see like a time where I would ever waste my time trying to make a contrary Shell Smash Shuckle. But this guy does, so I'm just like, well, okay then, I guess. So I go for a second Hydro Pump, somehow it doesn't kill because, well, it's Shuckle. And he goes for Rest, which is annoying. However, since I know that it's Rest, Infestation, uh, Shell Smash, and Sticky Web, uh, I'm just going to go for the Volt Switch. And Volt Switch into Azumarill. And Azumarill will pretty much just wreck, uh, wreck Shuckle's everything. It just, it just kills Shuckle, and yes, it is shiny. Also, it's like perfect. It's like perfect IVs except for its speed, which is 29. And it's shiny. I know. Get on my level. Anyways, go for the waterfall. See, look at it. It's tail glows. It's fucking awesome. Anyways, um, waterfall like does like 60%, which, I mean, I know it's Shuckle and it has a stat boost, but I mean, that's way less than I thought. It doesn't really matter, though. It's a 2 hit KO and uh, Shuckle dies, so that happens. Uh... So he goes back into Sableye, and honestly, thinking back in this battle, I should have just kept in Azumarill and waterfalled it. Because fuck Sableye. Obviously, I mean, I know I would get burned, but at least the Sableye would die. It like even with the burn, I would have easily taken it out with a with a waterfall. But uh, I didn't. I foolishly go into Trevenant and get burned, even though I have natural cure, so that doesn't matter. I was just hoping, like you know, he doesn't go for Taunt here. Which he didn't, because he's at under half HP, because he doesn't have leftovers, foolishly. But then I missed the Will-O-Wisp, and I'm just like, oh my god, I didn't burn it. Oh my god. And the thing that sucks is that with a team like I'm using, where I only have basically one special attacker that isn't powerful, um, Sableye pretty much forces you to, like, sack a Pokemon, or sack a Pokemon to get burned, to, like, kill it. And that's annoying, and I fucking hate it. <laughs> this is the reason why I should like this thing. This thing, like I've never had a problem with it. Like I mean, I guess I had sort of a problem. I mean, Sableye was all right last gen. But, I mean, this gen it just seems like it's just like with how the teams are now, it's just like Sableye can just like burn everything and just like troll your face. And I'm like, oh my god. So I do a bunch of switching shenanigans trying to like get him to not burn me or miss a will-o-wisp and not taunt me or something and it just never works out 
I know he was going to go for the taunt here, so he goes and run and wash, which was not right. But I guess he went for foul play, so I guess never mind. I should have just stayed in and willowist him, but whatever. Uh, um, yeah. This is like one of the reasons why I'm actually trying to get an aromatherapy or heal bell Pokemon onto my team, but I just don't know what. And yeah. Anyway, so I go for the Volt Switch, and he's basically at the exact same health where I had Azumarill last time, and I know Azumarill will take it out even if it's burned, so I was just like, fuck it, I'm gonna go into Azumarill. And Waterfall. I chose the Waterfall and not Aqua Jet because of the fact I'm fairly certain he would be faster. I know he has priority, so. But I'm slower speed. Especially with the Sticky Web, I'm fairly certain I was slower anyways, but yeah, so I go for Waterfall, it takes it out, and the Demon is gone. Threat averted. The only thing on his team that probably would have, like, annoyed my entire team to death is dead now. However, he goes into Reuniclus, but he goes into Reuniclus and takes Spikes damage, and I'm just like, what? He, he doesn't have Magic Guard. Magic Guard? Magic... Magic Guard, right? Yeah, Magic Guard. Anyways, uh, so I go into Titar to get some, you know, Sandstorm and, and Crunch on. Uh, he goes for the Calm Mind, and uh, he doesn't take Sandstorm damage. So that means not only does he not have Magic Guard, he doesn't have Regenerator. He has he has the other ability. Uh, the one, what is it called? Uh, Overcoat? The one where you're not affected by, like, just weather. And now I guess you're not affected by Spore moves. Which I guess would be a reason to use it. But I mean, it's Reuniclus. Like, if you're gonna have, like, Overcoat on something, like, bring, like, a Mandibuzz or something shitty. Not a fucking Reuniclus. Um, anyways, with, apparently, because I'm Sassy Nature and there's a Sticky Web, I'm somehow slower than a Reuniclus, which I never thought was possible. Um, but I am. And he takes me out with the Focus Blast after I crunch him, like, twice and get a defense drop. So, that happens. And he has, and he has Life Orb, too! So I'm just like, what? Why not just have Magic Guard? I mean, maybe... I, I I don't know. Like, I don't know what to think. He, he just... I don't know. So, I go for the Earthquake here. I did chose not to Mega Evolve to make him think I'm Scarfed, which makes him not want to go into Dugtrio or Lucario. And I wanted him to go into Titar anyways to get the uh, Sand Force boosted Earthquakes on. And uh, now I Mega Evolve. And uh, it, pre it pretty much just wrecks his face. In. So... Yeah, I hope that's like I hope I outplayed him. Maybe he's just bad and went into Titar, but I, whatever. Um, so yeah, that happens. Titar dies, and now he goes into Lucario, and I was just like, well, this is obviously his Mega Pokemon, and it, I should live this close combat. If I don't live this close combat, then Lucario needs to get banned. Like that's just ridiculous. If Mega Lucario is able to like Oko like a Pokemon with like 120 defense, like that's stupid. It, I mean, I live with 33 HP, which is still stupid, but. I, I don't know. I have a feeling it won't get banned only because there's so many ghost types. And I know that's a stupid excuse, but I think it's the excuse that'll happen, which is stupid. Anyways, so now he goes into Dugtrio. He goes for Shadow Claw, presumably because he has choice banded and he can't use Earthquake or else Rotom can come in, so whatever. So I go back into Zumaril. Uh, I decide to Waterfall and not Aqua Jet for whatever reason. I'm not sure why. But whatever, uh, Shadow Claw doesn't even come close to killing me anyways. And then uh, Waterfall takes him out, and that's the game. So, we've learned Sableye's annoying as fuck, and Shuckle sucks. So, that's pretty much it. Hope you guys enjoyed. Comrade sub, all that shenanigans, and yeah, see you.